He learned to play music, then learned to teach it. And now Pat Johnson is learning what it takes to reach people with his own music. Poised to release his debut CD, Pat Johnson took the time to tell us more about the disc, Boredom Built. Twenty-six years of service for night. Twenty-six years of service for night, man. Six years of service for night. Something's gonna break down because you gotta fill it. Teaching is my bread and butter, and then uh, I'm trying to get the singer songwriter thing rolling with the disc, and ultimately that's what I'd like to do. You know. But it's music full time, be it teaching or, or playing. The wheels on the road, the busting his ass in some sweaty shack. You gotta keep moving because he ain't going back. It's about two years, a little over two years ago, that I officially quit the day job and, uh, and pursued teaching full time. I'd been doing some teaching part time and uh, playing some gigs, and it just got to the point where I felt. You know, if I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, and I, I, the place I teach at in Brockville supported me, and we went for it. Well, you know, when you start playing music, when I started playing guitar, it was, and listening to music, it was all like I listened to The Who and Van Halen and, and things like that, you know, and then you start playing the guitar and, and you realize, you know, I like people like Doc Watson, and, and you listen to someone, and you watch someone play, and and you're thinking, you know, I was never into that, but look at that guy go, or look at her sing, and you, you get develop an appreciation for what people can do. And then I started getting more into roots type music. But the disc is kind of interesting because it, well, I think it's interesting, it's my disc. <laughs> but it's, the songs range from uh, acoustic blues, early acoustic blues styling, to uh, it's got reggae sounds, it's got some instrumental tunes in it, it's got some straight ahead rockers. But as a singer-songwriter, that's, that's my interest. So if I write a song and it'd be a blues song, or if I write a song and it'd be a folk song or a rock song, then, then that's the way it comes out. So it's, it's kind of an eclectic thing. Anything could inspire me, you know. Uh, typically, I, I'll grab snippets of my life and uh, maybe exaggerate them or, uh, you know, assimilate them with, with other experiences. And then some, some of the songs are stories, like 26 Years is a story pulled directly from my father's experience in the last couple of years. Um, Asbestos Sky is a song based on my day job. Soul in Its Place is one where I'm, I wrote it in the morning before I went to work. I used to practice in the morning and I was practicing away and the hook came and then the lyrics started to come and I just thought about my life and all the things I've done in the morning from being a child waiting to go to school to current day going off to work and just sort of placed those things and it just kind of came out that way. I find that when I'm writing songs, they're sort of given to you as opposed to forcing it out. I find that whenever I sit down and I force a song to happen, it, it feels forced. And, and I can hardly stand to sing it or listen to it myself. But if I'm just playing and the ideas come, you know, then I can tweak them a little bit. And I usually end up liking those songs. And I would say that that's pretty much what I, what I got with the disc. I bought the guitar. I bought the guitar to write songs, and that that's been my influence. That's been my my motivation, I guess, since I got involved with in it. So definitely, I would write, like to be considered a songwriter. That would definitely be, be the thing. I started playing the guitar and got hooked. You know, wow, this is fun. You know, but um, songwriting is definitely where I'd, I'd like to pursue. Up at the factory, taking them orders from a faceless wannabe. His hand doesn't shake when collecting his pay, cause he gotta stand tall on the judgment day. It's 26 years of service for nine, 26 years of service for nine, man. It's 26 years of service for nine. Something's gonna break down, cause you gotta feel it. Broken 
not bend Faceless bastards they cannot comprehend The golden years they tied and shut it all around And if they hide the way they lie six feet in the ground No, no, no Twenty-six years of service for nine Twenty-six years of service for nine 